engineer is being held prisoner at the Wat Sin barracks. You need to find him and get him out. He tried to defect from the base camp up north, but it didn't work out. Now they're holding him at Wat Sin. He's offered his technical skills to us as long as we can guarantee his safety. You have to extract the target. Boss, your target just happens to be the man who developed your prosthetic hand. He's the only one capable of maintaining it. If we bring him in, I'm sure he'll be able to modify it in all kinds of ways as well. So we've got four objectives in this mission. The first is we need to rescue a Soviet engineer. We need to rescue a, another prisoner who is plotting escape. We have to steal some blueprints and steal a jeep. Now these two serve a purpose later in the mission when it comes to stealing the jeep. And the reason we're not we're holding them up instead of knocking them out is that they'll never get off the ground if they've been told to stay in one place. The guards who have been knocked out will eventually always get up and sound an alert. And this is a little sneaky way into this base that bypasses a ton of guards. You have arrived at your destination. Next we're going to be rescuing the prisoner who's plotting escape. First we need to knock this boy out so he doesn't see us. And we're going to use him a little later too. The jeep that we can hear in the background is the jeep that we're going to be stealing at the end of the mission. This is the prisoner. We have to extract him over here, because any closer, a uh, guard will see him flying away and sound an alert. And this is where this boy's role comes into play. We count down from three, two, the map has one. Been okay, subject is in. Because right now there's two guards in the room below us and they need to hear me sprinting on the roof to come up and investigate. So when we run down into the basement, they'll already be have their backs turned to us, walking up the steps. Now we can just go and flatten them. And like with the other guards, we're going to hold them up so they don't get up and sound the alert when they wake up from being knocked out. And now we can go rescue the Soviet engineer. A bonus objective that we're going to do is extracting him through the hole in this roof. Not this. Yeah, he voiced yellow. It's a mush devil. Now all that's left is the blueprints and steel energy. I'm going to do the blueprints first. The blueprints are held in the guards' quarters on the other side of the base. Now that's some lateral thinking. Flawless work. You never cease to amaze, boss. Target extraction confirmed. Exfiltrate out of the hot zone by chopper or on land. Here's the blueprints. I'm going to sneak back the way we came. We can start sprinting here because we have enough cover. And now it's just a clean break back to that bridge where we knocked out those first two guards. And we'll wait for the jeep to drive over. We should have timed it pretty well that it should show up about the same time we get there. If anything, we're here a little early this time. There's the boy waiting for us, where we left him. And here comes the jeep. And when the driver of the jeep sees 
the guard on the ground, he's going to get out to go and investigate. And that'll let us sneak up behind him, knock him out, and steal the jeep. Like that. Big ol' punch. That's how I do mission five over the fence.